Hi, it's Dr. Rod from Devoted Vets here, and our special guest today is Doug the Bernese Mountain Dog. Today we're going to talk about the dangers of feeding dogs bones. Our aim, of course, is to keep teeth clean, white and shiny. And people feed dogs bones to do exactly this. And it works. There's nothing like bones for getting the teeth clean, white and shiny. But they come with three really significant dangers. The muscles of the dog's jaw are enormously powerful. And when they crunch on a bone, especially the harder bones, the bones can actually crack the teeth. And these big teeth up here, we're going to ask Doug to open his mouth. The big ones up there can actually break in half. And obviously that causes pain, dental disease, and ultimately the tooth has to be removed under general anaesthetic, even if the rest of the mouth is clean. The second problem is that they can cause obstructions inside. And the really dangerous one is a bone getting caught between the throat and the stomach. And uh, if that happens, it's a medical emergency and a surgical emergency. Um, the dog suddenly loses appetite, becomes uncomfortable, it extends its head. And ultimately, uh, in examination, um, the suspicion is drawn to the esophagus or food pipe. And the area is x-rayed, the bone shows up, and then, then the dog has to have open chest surgery to remove the offending bone. The other area they can get stuck is in the intestines, and sometimes we have to go in to the abdomen. Less dangerous for the dog, but still a risk and remove bones from the intestine. And then lastly, the third reason we don't feed dogs bones is the dogs powder the bones up, especially the marrow, and that bone powder causes constipation. And if a dog becomes constipated, the jagged bone fragments stop the poo passing along uh, the large intestine into the rectum. So these dogs need an enema. In those cases, the dog has to be, uh, again, anaesthetized and the rectum and the part of the large bowel pumped free of all that bone powder. So three good reasons why not to feed your dog's bones. They crack the teeth, they can get caught in either the esophagus to the stomach or in the intestines, and lastly they cause constipation. We don't want that though, do we? In another video coming up, we'll talk about other ways, safe ways, to keep your dog's teeth clean, white and shiny. Some people might ask, well, how common are these things? And um, I would rather take the risk and feed my dog's bones. Well, fractured teeth are very common and we give enemas to dogs uh, quite a lot as well. So um, on the balance, there are safer ways to keep the dog's teeth clean and shiny and healthy. And we'll see you at Devoted Vets where magic and happiness happens. Doesn't it? Yes. Yeah.